Hey folks, Quilly Team here, and welcome to another episode of Let's Play StarCraft II Zerg vs. Ladder Season 2. We're currently ranked 1 in Platinum 2. Now, hopefully this is going to go okay. I actually just tried to start a game uh, like a little bit ago. Uh, I was getting a really annoying lag. I mean, I'm still in Europe playing on the NA server. I got so much lag, just constant micro stutters over and over and over again that I just ended up rage quitting. I was like, Bleh! And then, so I've rebooted the computer, rebooted the router, did all that. Hopefully... That's still not happening. Like, it was this sort of thing where it was just like a second or two at a time, almost nonstop. It's like the most frustrating situation in the universe. So here's hoping that that fixed things. I mean, it doesn't help that I'm playing from Europe, but I want to play my main account, you know, just to, to get a good sense of things. So we're going to do that. You're going to be built. And in the talking, I've already screwed up my, my uh, build order again. Well, less less screwing up the build order, more screwing up the, the timings. So we'll see. So we're up against another Terran. Last video was just Terran. Uh, the, the last game was against uh, Zerg. And it was like, it was. I think it was going to go good. I think I got a big like build order advantage and everything like that. And then um, it turns out microing Zerglings and Banelings with uh, like micro starters of lag. Really tough. Really tough. Here, like, I think against Terrans, the, like, Micro Wars are a little different, unless I'm going to be forced into uh, Ravagers, then we'll see. All right, you're going to do that, you're going to go there, you're going to do that, you're going to go there, excellent. You do that. Now, some people do Gasly Starts, um, and does give you a stronger economy early on, which is very interesting. But, despite the fact that I'm always late on my Zergling speed, I think going the gas route is still better. Alright, you got that, you got that. Uh, you guys are working in there. You know, a little slower. I don't start the, uh, the Zergling speed as, as early as I could, but I think I start it as early as... You know, so I think this delayed gas is fine. Uh, I want one more worker. Boom. And then we're going to get ready to do some transfers. And I just transfer eight. I don't know. There's probably some optimal amount. But it, it's roughly half my mineral miners, right? Is, is what's going on there. So something like that. Seems relatively sane. We got you. We got you. We got you. We got... Where are the minerals? I there we go. The so minerals. four pack of Zerglings. The two queens are underway. That's going to be cool. All right. So other than that, I got to keep pumping out workers. Uh, we've got... Okay, racks into factory, which doesn't really tell me much. You're slightly annoying, so I'm going to move you over there. Um, and you're just going to go over there for now. We're going to get some more workers at this point. There's my 30. Now, I'm a s I am actually can't tell if you've got the expansion out here. Hold on, you got to come here you and then go there. Queen. Those hatcheries won't inject themselves. So he might chase you down. Come, queen. Come and come and do this. I, I kind of need to know if he's got another base. Yeah, he does. Okay, he's expanded. So that's good. Yeah, and you just try to um, run that way. And then run over there. You might get killed. Hello. So let's get another couple of dudes over here. Let's get some of you over this way. We didn't start our Zergling speed, because why would we? We're going to queue up two queens, because um, I may as well spend the micro on it right now, since I... Can't build anything more substantial. We're going to kill that dude over there. Not that I'm worried about him doing anything. He's probably mostly just forgot about him. And that's okay. Um, let's get a crap ton of workers. What do you like in minerals? You make a boring charm. Not enough Same thing minerals. here. And so what I need to sort of know is how bio heavy is he going? He's probably going for something like your sort of typical kind of bio medevac. I mean, he didn't go like Reaper first or anything. I always want you flat broke, Matt. God save your gracious queen. More queens. Hello. Inject. Inject. Do a bunch of that. I know I'm like working things inappropriately. Okay. So it definitely looks like Lingbane is going to be a good response to this. So, we are going to need a little bit more gas going on here, but not much. Mostly what we're going to want to do is transfer a little bit more over here, and a little bit more over here, and maybe get a couple more queens going on. just tends to be good. I do want to start probably an armor upgrade Your over here. And started a progressive folk 
Um, let's get some Zerglings, be ready for a push. And yeah, we're gonna get the um, Carapace going as soon as we get a chance. Uh, so we got that. You're up, and we're not actually building from you. You're gonna do that. Just go Zerglings now. Thank you. And thank you. And yeah, we're gonna go that, that, that. And we got a couple more queens. Good. Um, boop, boop, boop. Boop, boop, boop. Boop, boop, boop. Many Zerglings. Or, I mean, Overlords, of course. Uh, carapace, 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 carapace. Okay, there we go. Not enough energy. Okay, speedlings are a go. Just not energy to do that right now. A few more overlords. I'm just gonna take a quick energy. little peek here. Actually, I'm gonna do instead of an attack move, I'm gonna move and then move back. That's what I'm looking to do, and see how that is. A few more zerglings. I know we don't have full saturation. But, oh, hello. Hello. Protect your How ah, you there we go. Stage? That's what's going on. I'm like, hang on. Where's all the, uh... Where are the minerals? I was told there would be minerals. Okay, that should be okay. Come over here, attack the tanks, kill the medevacs, rebuild some... Drones over here. And that. Okay, so we did lose plenty of drones. All the rebuilding them should be okay. Um, we're going to come over here. You guys are going to come back over here. Actually, let's go and make sure we got the gassing going. Alright, he's got a lib over there. But... Having lost the entire attack. That's fine, we're not sticking around over there. It's okay. We're gonna do this. I'm gonna move over here. I'm gonna re-drone some more. He's still just on the two bases. My liege, the coffers lack minerals. Alright, we got some of that going on. Keep going with drones. Although we can get to the point where you are droning to there and you are droning to there. You're going to do some of that. You're going to do some of that. You're going to do some of that. We've actually got too many drones. Come back, Zerglings! Where? Oh, no, that's my... Oh, that's fine. Shit, man. If you want to keep building air units, I'm going to be okay with that. Even if you've got an expansion over there. Okay, then I will simply go and attack you over here. Okay, let's come back out over here. So you're going to have Liberator stuff and things. Uh, we're probably going to need some anti-air. Um, I don't have a spawning pool. Oh, shit. That is less than great. And nothing ever upgraded over here. Um, let's go and get this. We're going to get a roach. Oh, I can't because I can't get the next level. Can I build another evo chamber? I can't. Okay. So I guess what you're going to do is build a crap ton more drones. And what we're going to do is we're going to expand to the gold over here. And make sure to get all these gases. Like that, like that. You're gonna double tap that. Double tap that. Double tap that. Then what you're going to do is you're going to come out here and just build a crap ton of creep. Since apparently I have nothing else to do with my APM right now. Uh, because I didn't rebuild the spawning pool. All right, good stuff. I'm gonna do that, that. So yeah, the ability to tech up again is gonna be a little bit impaired. Um, we got way too many dudes over here. Come there, do that, and take another one here and send you over there. Great. Um, so we got you. Wow, Let's you go and whack on that. Come over here. So you've got. You've got this going on over here. So I just gotta make sure you're part of the hotkey system. Uh, you're scanning me over here. Tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna drop and drop like that. And I'm worried a little bit about Liberator uh, annoyance in the back over here. So let's do a little bit of that and that, and that's gonna be okay. And over here we're gonna do this and that. And 
let's get a bunch of Zerglings again in case he decides to come across the way and kill me. Um, and we're going to go and do that. And since you're idle, I'm going to go ahead and start this. It's not actually what I'm looking for, but let's do it. And even though I really don't need it, we're going to go ahead and get started on there. Excellent. And let's go and take a little visit right here and do that. That unit has even more aggressive. So, Queens, uh, remember how like larva is important for Zerg? Let's uh, get a little bit of that going on. You're evolving, that's good. You've got this, which is that. You're gonna kill that. As long as you don't come any further, we're going to be okay. And you have some extra Zerglings here, too. Mineral field depleted. Boom, 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 boom. Wow, you mined all those minerals already. All right. That wasn't necessarily cost efficient, but it's going to be okay. You're going to do some of this. You've got that, so you're going to go and build me one of these. And one of those. And you're going to get me another level of carapace. Go, go, go. Try building that monstrosity elsewhere. Okay, I'm surprised he's not attacking me yet. I think it's a mistake, because I think he could easily kill me if he decided to come at me right this second. So, I mean, I'm relatively pleased that he's not, I guess. Uh, you do have a little bit of vision over there. Uh, so I'm just waiting for the Spire, which does take forever. Okay, we're going to get some Hydras in the meantime, so I've got a little bit of anti-air options. Don't just stand there, shoot back! Okay. Okay, that should actually be surprisingly okay. There we go. All right, good stuff. Oh, wow! Uh, <laughs> I didn't expect that. I mean, I guess I did shut down his earlier attack, like... I mean, I lost some stuff, admittedly, but he lost his whole army. And this is probably him rebuilding his whole army. And I'm not sure he's, he had a third. So, and I did have the fourth up. And the thing is, with my uh, Spire up, I mean, we were certainly going to go and progress upwards in tech very quickly. Get some Corruptors out just to make sure that Libs weren't going to be a problem. But yeah. And I'm pretty sure that getting the, um, the Carapace upgrades early, like, I've really, like, discovered that, at least for Terran... Um, finally learned that, like, Zerglings with a Carapace upgrade really hold you for a long, long time. So, you know, the occasional pokes we were doing over there, we did do a little bit of economic damage to him, so I guess there was that. I mean, he did a little bit back. Um, that might actually be an interesting one to see the replay, you know, to, to check all the numbers. Um, I don't, I think if I lo left, or loaded this now, it wouldn't be good. I don't know if we can, like, load graphs at this point. Probably not. I mean, without interrupting this. No, I think it'll cancel the load. And I do want to play another game real quick. Take a look at the league. There you are. 11 and 9. Game ready. Okay. 287 points. Look at this guy. He's got 28, but he doesn't have that many points. Why? Did he start from, like, a lower league? Did he get placed in, like, bronze or something? Maybe that's why. 16-bit <sighs> LE. This has got the back expansion. We've got a random over here. Now, random usually means a little bit easier. Um, because they're... He's saying Terran. I don't necessarily, you know, believe him, but we'll see. Um, because it usually means a lower degree of, of general expertise with each race. Now, he might have one that he's particularly good at. Um, and he might end up with that one as the race for this particular game. So... Slow, fat, gassy, and essential. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go. Go, go, go. You're gonna come over here, get Mr. 17, and go from there. 
I mean, I think there's a perception that randoms might cheese a little bit more, but I, I, in my experience, that hasn't been the case. Because I think you have to really go in and, like, know the, the cheese build orders. Like, if you, you know, run up against a Protoss, then you might, you have to be worried about getting Cannon Rush, for example. But someone randoming a Protoss might not have those timings locked in to the same degree to be a dangerous, you know, Cannon Rusher, for example. I'm not saying, you know, I'm not trying to be stereotypical about Protosses and Cannon Rushing. I'm just using an example of N cheese. And actually, if you're talking about, like, Zerg these days, it's not like, you can't just, like, you know do a super early spawning pool rush the same way anymore. I mean, you can go, like, fairly early, but it's not it's not the same. And with Terran, other than, like, you know, proxy barracks type stuff, which, again, is not it's not quite the same. It's earlier than expected aggro, but it's not even necessarily an all-in, in, in some senses, depending on how much damage you can pull off uh, along the way. So, we're gonna get a Zerg Cocoon. Oh, he actually is Terran! Alright, alright. Let's get this over here, and we can get one more worker. So he might just be escaping. I don't think he's building, like, buildings inside my base or anything. I'm really not worried about that SCV. I was probably a little early. I might get some guys that go back and forth, so I might have to manually double-check that um, they're not running back too early, especially the ones that already have minerals in their mouths. Queen, Zergling, Queen. Yeah, see, Quickly now. do that, and then go back there. Uh, get another Zergling, and you're just going to go and check over here. And other than that, we're going to do this and that. And we're going to get speed much faster. And I could go and pull the um, the drones off gas, which is another thing that people do if they're really, you know, impressive and skillful. Um, but I'm just going to forget to put it back on when I'm going to need it. It's going to be a reactor. It's going to be reactor. Okay. okay. So fairly early ground aggression. Probably Marines. Did I not actually start the Queen here? I don't think I did. So I'm going to queue up another one. That's going to be fine. Get some more of those. I mean, that's all good. And yeah, you're going to come here, and then you're going to hide off into the fog. And then you're coming here to confirm that there's no expansion right away. And uh, we're going to get you to come right over here so that you can go and scooch in a bit later on. And that's going to be fine. Overlords, the supply depots of the sky. Uh -huh. The supply depots of the sky. I think these guys can get shot if I put them out your there, but... And it's all your overlord's fault. All right, we're going to just be idiotic and do some of that. Um, we're also going to do this over here. That's going to be fine. Hello, you have queens. Queen. Queens. And I'm actually going to prioritize connecting my bases, even though I, I don't think that's the right thing and indeed not what most people do, but I like it. Um, with the early expansion, I can that's really, smarter, and the safe expansion faster, in the back... Yeah expand early. In fact, I should have expanded before this. Uh, let's send you guys out over here, just my little speed links. To do that right now. <clears throat> and do this. Alright, so all of this has been terrible. Fair enough. Uh, Queen's ready. We're going to get Where another round of speed links to, to sort of be ready to do a little bit of poke, poke, harass, harass. Whoa, whoa, you can't build your horrific biomass here. <laughs> Not enough help. I mean... Yeah, literally just sort of one of those little looksies. Okay, and mostly have enough zerglings to be ready to do baneling shenanigans. Because we have the baneling nest built, which is nice. We got you coming in over here. You're not done yet, which is fine. We're gonna get a bunch oh, more of these and stuff maybe i guess you're still on a cooldown okay just not uh let's get some more of those everyone come out here banglings overlords right turns out that's something we need okay uh we're gonna go and inject inject you're gonna come around this way and then the rest of the queens are just gonna spread a shit ton of love and then everyone's gonna come over here like that and you, need more energy. you guys, we're going to have more Bane Links. Okay. Not enough, not enough of that speed, and that's fine. And then there's more right dudes to follow up with. All right. So you're going to come up here, you're going to attack that way, and then just, like, generally move forward. Because I think there's still going to be a lot of bio just standing there. Boop, 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 boop. Hey, more Banelings. 
<laughs> Peek around this way. Hey, look at that! We're bringing a bunch more dudes in here. I think that might be the end of him. I was like, do I build a bunch of banelings on the outside of stuff? I don't think that's going to be required. It's hard to imagine him having an economy after this. Kill that dude. Come down here. Just keep flooding in lings. There you go. GG! Well then. Yeah, the, the, the random player uh, is always going to have a bit of that. Let's go to the replay over... That's an AI replay. But... What? Why would this be my second most recent replay? Quit replay. Hello, replays. Oh! Okay, scroll. So that's the guy I just did, Miss Cliff Massacre, and then this guy is the one before that, right? Was it in this map? I mean, it must have been. So let's watch solo, but really we're watching with others, obviously. Y'all here. Um, yeah, 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 that's right. What is this? Okay, so... Let's increase the speed to times four for a bit here. I'm just trying to get an idea as to like, how much damage is really done to this dude? Uh, I guess we can take a look at like units over here, just compare some of the worker stats. So, I mean, he expands right away. Comes across the way. Let's a good look at the production tab too, but that's all right. He's got his unit over here. We're up to the 20 workers. Got that. He's roaming around this way. Still thinking about doing the early expansion, probably. Workers are the same. He's hunting that down, which is a little annoying and unfortunate. There's not like a good hiding spot right by the base. I suppose like, if I come through and then ran away this way, it would have been okay. Handful of Zerglings coming forward. I've got slightly more workers. He's got the two... Um, the two Marines. I expand over there. And then I think... Uh, I think I lose a, a dude or two here. Okay, I keep him alive because I run away because of that, and I'm like, okay, we can deal with this crap. That's going to be okay. I have to rebuild my overlords, but my third base is still coming up. He's got the starport coming up, so it's like a 1-1-1 one, one, one kind of thing happening here. Now, I know uh, when I watch StarCraft tournaments these days, I keep talking about 2-1-1, one, one, which I think is two, two barracks, right? One, oh, there's not even a reactor or a tech lab over here. Oh, well, shit. Okay. No, no. So there's no stem, no reactor, like... Sacrifice some dudes to get a little bit of an idea. I see a lot of marines. I'm like, okay, so um, the baneling nest is going to be a good way to go. Banelings and, and zerglings is going to be okay because... Uh, and at some point, I'm like, uh, evolution to be able to get carapace, which I should have started sooner. As soon as you see a lot of, like, this, exactly, it's like, it's the perfect time to get carapace. I'm still only beating him by, like, the tiny bits of workers. Although, you know, got the third base up and running. So he's got two bases fully saturated. I got three bases that are not fully saturated. Um, but my production's getting up there. In fact, he's gone over me in SCVs. But I'm building my army and rushing him. I'm like, okay, there might be a timing. He's going to drop in the back here, though, which is very nice. Now, I'm forced to turn around. Well, no, I definitely am with the explosion, I think. But there's the, you see that there's that moment of, oh, no, that's right. I had queued that. That wasn't me hesitating or turning around. I actually hadn't noticed the drop yet. But luckily, speedlings are pretty fast. Now, there's not a units... Oh, here we go. Units lost. Pause. Uh, just 44. I need, like... Observer shortcut. Okay. Name panel. Ooh, spiffy. Minerals? Okay, that's just that toggle. Uh-huh. Yeah, I don't know. APM. That's seriously my APM compared to someone else. Uh, okay. I mean, some of that is probably while I'm like holding down a key. That's just an auto spam thing. Come back in here. Do some of that. So I've got way more supply. I've killed just a bunch of his units over here. Or a bunch of his, his workers. Pull back. He's got his base trying to get established. I still got the third. Like, I don't have, like... Well, now I'm up 10 workers, which is pretty good. 
Is there any chance he just like GG when he saw the extra base over here after I got it set up? My Connie's been going, going up like crazy. Okay, the timing attack, like building a bunch of Zerglings there, like cutting um, Zerglings, or sorry, cutting pr drones for a bit and get building a bunch of Zerglings, I think worked out well. I clearly did a lot of damage over there. I've got enough shit roaming around here to continue to disrupt his economy. I'm 20 drones ahead. Okay. You know, I think it's one of those things where I really had no idea how far ahead. And then, like, just sort of stopped doing things over here. Interesting. Oh, and then there's, like, effective... Um, effective APM, basically? Something like that. Okay. Hide that. Oh, my God. I've got to double his workers now. Um, there's another list for army supply. Oh! Well, shit, that's really handy. So I have, like... I have much less army supply than he does, much bigger economy, but I've got a good, like, I've been mostly keeping an eye. Again, I think this was a part of the game where I was like, if he attacks me right now, I'm pretty sure I die because I had like no army, right? I sacrificed a bunch over there, but I think he was, because I was, you know, attacking him, he was feeling that pressure. I still have, well, a more army supply. It's not completed units yet. I think I'm spamming out a ton of Zerglings at this point. Yeah, because I lost that, which really screwed up. Like, he should have gone for, like, an all-in kind of timing. And then I got this, these guys, because I assumed his base was back. That's indeed the case. He does have this. He's got the tanks set up. Well, the tanks are too far back to help in this. Now, I don't know if this is good. He actually is passing me an overall supply now. And I'm going to drop a bunch of supply over here. He actually built a bunch of workers, too. Boom, 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 boom. So yeah, I lose a ton again. Sorry, I I'm, think I'm getting confused about the counts. No, I'm way ahead on workers. I'm getting confused as to the numbers. I'm red over here. I'm not like top versus bottom. Red over here. I'm still rebuilding the military lot because I know what he's got. I know he's coming at me. I've got this. We are desperately trying to get the Hydralist dent up. If he had gone right away, I think he would have just killed me. He's got a lot of tanks, but he's got a lot of Marines. And hang on a sec. Wow, is there going to be a single marine left for me to click on and check upgrades from here? <clears throat> he's got the tech lab now. Yeah, okay. So he's got, he's got you know, some things going on for upgrade-wise. I just rip apart the marines, and then, yeah, without marines, you can just throw zerglings at tanks, and it's pretty easy. Um, the tanks do a pretty good number of the hydras, but they weren't sieged up instantly. Uh, we kill the tanks before we worry about engaging the hydras, and that's that. I think I did read it wrong that there were several times I could have lost. And the thing is, I'm not sure that throwing like a million um, Banelings into a base is necessarily always worthwhile. I don't know if it was worthwhile there, especially with the um, the Liberator. I could have waited. I could have kept up some Banelings parked over here and kept an eye on, the, on his army. And when it moved out, then just send in the Banelings or something like that. Still, I mean, the results are good. Still trying to learn from everything. Thanks for watching, folks. I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.